morning friends and happy Wednesday. We're almost one twelfth of the way through the year already. That's insane. It's currently 10.21 so I am getting kind of a late start to the day. I had such a weird sleep last night. It was so stormy. I'm pretty sure my power went off for a little bit. The lightning and thunder very loud, very bright. So yeah, I had a bit of a weird sleep. And then when my alarm went off this morning, I was like, no, no, mm, we're not going to do that today. I spent the whole day yesterday printing all of these vinyls. There's like over 50 here. And now I'm up to the tedious task of taking the background off of each of these so that then I can heat press them onto more pencil cases. And hopefully by the time that I get through all of these, I think we should only have like maybe 30 pencil cases left after that. So yeah, I also have a whole roll of white vinyl that I need to cut on my Cricut. I'm truly just trying to make that my priority in terms of work for the next one to two weeks. I've also been spending a lot of my time this week so far cutting out handmade stickers. How cute. So when we launch the Easter coloring book in March, I'm planning on doing a new handmade sticker pack, which obviously is going to be Easter themed for the Easter show. And these sticker packs are also going to go in the show bag. So these are just a few of the designs. You guys know I love my podcasts, so I'll normally just put on a super long podcast and just sit here and cut and listen and watch. I also have bookmarks that I need to make. I've been kind of slack at, you know, getting on top of them. I did like two or three batches in a row last week and then this week she's been slack and I hate how messy it is so I procrastinate but it needs to get done so I might do that for the TikTok live this afternoon. The weather today is muggy. That's that's the word to describe it. Muggy. Hot, sweaty, gross. So I think the plan for later on today is to take all of the show stuff that I have piled up over here to my dad's house and go for another swim like I did last week because that was the best. It was a really, really nice reset, especially for like midweek. That's my plan for today. Come along with me. I know a lot of you guys want to see vlogs based around prep for the Easter show, which is literally what I'm doing every day now with doing all these vinyl cutting, weaving, heat pressing, sticker cutting, like all of this stuff. And the majority of my work for the next couple months will just be prepping for the show. I've done all my other work for up until after the show. It's just getting in and getting things organized. So hopefully you enjoy seeing the behind the scenes. It's very repetitive, I'm sorry about that. But it's just the way it is. It's just what happens when I'm only one person trying to do so many different things. I have to do the same thing multiple days in a row. So yeah, I haven't had any breakfast yet and it's like I said, 10.30. So I need to have some food. I think I might have yogurt. I'm starving. It's way, way past my breakfast time. And then get into waving these lovely, lovely things. seven p.m. and I'm sitting here sweating it's so warm I don't even know if the weather will say that it's that hot but it's just an uncomfortable temperature like it's an uncomfortable feeling feels like 35 if I'm gonna be honest it's it's not fun I have just weaved a couple of vinyl sheets two, four, six, seven. So not a whole lot, but we've started and that's the main thing. I've also cut out some more stickers like you saw. So I'm making my way with those as well. I think I'm just gonna go to my dad's now, if I'm gonna be honest. I'm gonna take these boxes. I'm gonna go 
sit in the pool. I need to uh, figure out a way to take these down to the car. I'm gonna have to do a couple trips, which I hate. I am that bitch that will try and take everything down in one trip, but I definitely cannot take like four boxes down in one trip. Let's try and get these boxes up and together. One of these boxes is half full, so I'm gonna leave one and a half just for if we get any store orders for notebooks and for markets and stuff like that. But then I'll take the bottom two and this full box here to go and put in storage. And then this area will feel a little more tidy as well. You probably can't hear me at all because I've got the aircon blasting, but this car has never, ever been this full. Like I've just jam packed so much more stuff in here. These two boxes need to go to my dad's. I need to stop at the post office to drop this off. And then I've got the other box that's the same size as this all the way back in the very, very back. Hi, my sweet boy. Hello, see me. Hello, are you on the other side? I just saved the bee from drowning. I'm so incredibly grateful that I can do this for a day in the life. I don't think I've actually ever shown you guys the room that I store all the stuff for the markets in, but this is her. This is it. This is just a spare room at my dad's. He's obviously got his own stuff down here. Wines, wine glasses and whatnot. My sister used to use this room as like a gym room. Hence the treadmill and the weights up the back there. But yeah, I will hopefully be able to fill all this space here. So yeah, this is all the stuff that we have already got in here. It's crazy how much it piles up when I'm only just bringing like a couple things at a time. So in this box, we have hats and a couple pencil cases. We've got the two big tubs of chupa chup for the show bags. This is a box full of the oopsie tote bag, which aren't for the show, but they're just here for storage anyways. I've got three massive boxes full of carry bags. I don't even know what else is in here like what's in this box oh i think that's market stuff oh my gosh the very first market back that i did i was missing a couple things and this is the box that they're in i have calendars in here like this whole big handful is calendars so i'm actually really glad that i just found that while showing you guys because i need to sell these and get rid of them and i think those are just plant books which are fine i'll just keep them in here for the show but yeah then we've got like another box under here which i think is more pencil cases um i just brought the two a4 notebooks over from home today and then this is the box full of tote bags so this is the room you guys that we will probably spend a lot of time in come march i want to be able to like maybe set you guys up on the shelf over here and do a full-on like room time lapse of me setting up all of the show bags i think that would be really fun it's going to be a task, that's for sure. Come the beginning of March, the goal is to have the majority of everything in here. That's a little tour of all the stuff that I've got in here so far. Updates to come, I guess, as I bring more stuff over. I'm back home now. I look crazy. And I'm about to make myself an iced tea. I actually got this tea from my friend Bianca for Christmas. I steeped some the other day to have a hot one when it was a little bit colder and I had heaps left over. So I put it in the fridge. It looks like piss, but I promise it's good and it was really, really good hot. Let's see. I don't know what I was expecting, but it wasn't that. I don't know. Maybe it's a bit too watery. I think maybe that's my problem. I think it's just very watery, but that's fine. It's almost two o'clock now, so I have two hours before I have to be on TikTok Live, so back to these bad boys it is. Wish me luck. It's now 3.30 and I have just finished setting up all the stuff to make resin. I've got the little leaves, I've got all the bookmark molds laid out, and I've also got a ton of different colored flowers over here, and then just like random extra flowers and stuff here. I have the TikTok Live all set up and ready to go as per usual. It's only 3.37 so I am going to be a little bit early but I really don't mind. The sooner I get this done 
the better. I will show you the finished result once I'm done. Can someone tell me why my washing machine is doing this to all my white clothes? It's so annoying. I literally just washed all my white sheets all together, just white, nothing else. Why is this happening? It's disgusting. I'm mad about it. <laughs> Here's a little update on the bookmarks. I did finish them quite a while ago, but I promised that I would show you guys what they look like afterwards. So this is what they look like. This is my favorite batch, but everything's a bit of a mess. I honestly just can't right now. Like I can't, I'm gonna leave it because I don't want to be around the stuff, breathing it in. So I'm gonna make some dinner. It's 5.30, so by the time I put something in the oven or cook something, it should almost be six o'clock. Chicken tacos it is. All I really have to do is cook the chicken and put the taco seasoning on. I get it from Aldi. I think you can get it from Coles as well. I'm not 100% sure. But yeah, I'm literally just gonna cook that in the pan, chop up some cheese, tomato, onion, lettuce. I'm so excited. So good. This looks so good. I haven't had tacos in ages. So I'm so excited. I think I'm gonna sit down and watch some Dynasty while I eat this, if I'm gonna be honest. That's what I'm gonna do for the next like hour, probably. Mm -hmm. 